green is the new gold standard when it comes to decor, and spring is just screaming for you to add green to your home. And here with a beautiful living wreath that you can create at home is Liz Bouchon. Thank you so much for coming in. Oh, you're welcome. So we're talking about this living wreath down yes. here. Yes. Um, we're going to actually learn how to make this. So yes. what are the supplies that we need? All right, well, first of all, it is living, and the reason we call it living is because it has pansies and, and petunias in it and okay. greenery and moss. So you start with a wire wreath. Actually, I had to order the, the wreath online, and okay. it's called a living wreath, and you will fill the wreath with this coconut moss, and it's a, like a liner, and it's supposed to help control the dirt. So mm -hmm. you're going to use peat moss and a little bit of fertilizer, in your mix and the coconut uh, shell or lining will soak up the water Oh! and then you have a back piece on the back of the wreath you close that off and you're going to put moss on the back side of that. I have pictures and all this is explained on my website okay. lizbashong.com you yeah. can go there and find it. And okay so this is what it looks like. Yes that's the liner and then you see the potting mix there yeah. it's filled with the potting mix and okay. then you add the back and then you're going to turn it over and then the tricky part is cutting a hole in this coconut liner. It's oh, kind of difficult. Okay. So you have to take an awl or something and then get your scissors in there and cut it. Okay. And then you take individual little plants and plant it. Wow. And, and then, then it's so beautiful. And what you do, you have to let that you have to water it really really well. Then you okay. have to let it set for a couple of days so that the roots start to take root. Okay. Actually, you may want to do it like a week or so. Okay. Because it's real important be that you don't hang it up too soon. And I would not put this on a front door if you have a lot of sun because it will dry out faster and you'll have to water it. When you water it, you have to take it off, lay it down flat, and water it. So okay. it's a little bit tedious, but it's so pretty. You can change this out for different annuals, different seasons, and uh, continually, you know, use it. But it's very heavy, so you would probably want to hang it on a brick wall or, Got it. or even use it Something as a that can hold centerpiece it. for your dining table outside it would be gorgeous yes you know, put a clay pot in there and put some herbs or something in there or vegetables or something you know be really really pretty absolutely so we're so, also talking about this so we're yes. gonna create this yes this okay. is a, I call this a porch pot okay and it cannot be easier you first of all you start with an urn of some sort okay. and uh, you can buy this in any Home Depot Lowe's whatever inside I put a clay pot upside down because we're gonna just buy a potted plant and we're gonna stick it on the inside okay which is what I'm gonna go ahead and do right now just stick that on there easy enough yeah and see that just kind of elevates it now on the outside edges of this urn I use some outdoor moss the green moss yes yes I found that in my yard okay. some people if you have shady area it'll grow in your yard you can just dig it up and then just lay it on top of your um, arrangement and then some moss and the birds will absolutely love it yes I should have put this on first but anyway I didn't so you want to put your grapevine wreath around it okay. and if you need to elevate that up a little bit more you can mm -hmm. you can do that and then the last thing you're going to do is you're just oops, do you just me. find these in your yard yeah yes yeah, so sticks great. in the yard you okay. know just stick those in there and you can create your uh, branch yes. like that so it's really kind of fun and change you can change this out per season okay if you want to different holidays yeah you know you can set this inside outside. and that really was so easy yeah all right and this is also on your website yes ma'am okay Great. everything's there yeah what is your website uh lizbushong.com okay all right, well, we will have a link to her website on our website. Just go to daytimebluebridge.com. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. 